Hey guys, Mike here with Ring Partner again. Just wanted to go over a couple things about landing pages. And uh, what we're looking at here is one of our landing pages that we use internally. And uh, what I wanted to explain is that you know when we're driving traffic from mobile search, we don't really worry too much about our landing page because we are driving so much of the traffic through the click to call Google ad extension. Uh, and so a very small percentage of our users actually hit the landing page. But for those ones that do, you're going to want to make sure that you capture those as well. So usually what we do is hard code that phone number onto the page and we make a big button that is visible and clickable or tappable on a mobile phone. So this page here is optimized for mobile because we are doing mobile search. Uh, we placed our number all over the page and we have uh, very few actual pages here. This is a one page site and we've made sure that we have a privacy policy and a contact us page. Uh, and of course the phone number again all over the page. And what you want to do to make those clickable on a phone and to generate the call prompt is, is create a tell link. So that's T-E-L colon in front of your href links in HTML. But one thing to note as well is I've listened to a couple webinars uh, on uh, landing pages and as long as there's no uh, links to URLs outside of your domain. So this is hosted on 1-800-getdegrees-.com and this is the root domain. This is the site. This is all there is to it. It's a one-page site with a privacy policy and a contact us page. And in listening to that webinar, what I heard was Google will allow you to place a phone number on a page and as long as there are no links to other URLs that aren't the, set, the same as the root domain, you're good to promote that page. You may get only a three or four quality score and you won't be able to bump up your quality score on Google without more content or more pages, but you won't get disapproved ads or have your account banned. So you can place phone numbers on a page and send traffic through your one page landing pages. So one other thing that we suggest doing with your landing page is potentially using keyword insertion to place the keywords on the page or you can use uh, a number insertion in order to place the number on the page so that you can change that from the different numbers you've selected within the Ring Partner platform to populate the page. And that just helps for another level of, of tracking on a, on a very simple basis. So that kind of covers everything for landing pages. Uh, but what I did want to share with you is that Ring Partner has uh, sort of partnered up, partnered up with Unbounce. And we, uh, we also really love to use Unbounce. It's great for drag and drop landing pages so that you can generate a bunch of landing pages really simply. They look really nice. And if you don't, if you're like me and you don't code and you don't design, it's a great way to make landing pages really simply that look really professional. And so if you sign up with Ring Partner, uh, you'll get a, a link to check out this page and you can sign up with the promo code Ring Partner. You can also just go to unbounce.com and use the promo card code Ring Partner and sign up and you'll get 50% off for three months. And you know, feel free to send us a message and we'll tell you how to best use Unbounce and uh, how you can get started using those landing pages. And it's a really quick and easy way to just bang out a nice landing page and get your campaign set up uh, really quickly because you're gonna need a landing page for uh, Google even though you don't wanna send your traffic there necessarily. So that's a uh, quick summary of you know, what you need to do for landing pages. As usual, if you need help with this, contact your affiliate manager. If you need a landing page built, we're happy to build one for you. Just again, reach out to your affiliate manager and we'll get you started. Thanks and have a good one.